That's why our administration has moved aggressively to secure our borders. Trump. I bet it fits. Everybody in town know him? Mm -mm. But they're all willing to believe what he says. We're not going to stop up their ears. He's supposed to give us the whole story tonight. I don't intend to sit here and be insulted, Sheriff. If your people don't want my help, I can go elsewhere. Oh, wait a minute, Mr. Trump. He don't more by hiring a record number of new border guards. The world trial. He could be, uh, he could be really genuinely funny in, uh, in, in conversation. Uh, well, I remember once we were on the subject of, uh, of uh, Pierre Trudeau. In the military world, the citizen military gap is closed. And his... Uh, Probably to be so with politics. ...as many victories um, in, in, in elections. He said, you know, the reason Trudeau is so successful um, is that he has the name of a Frenchman, the mind of an Englishman, um, and the face of an Indian. With the advent of electric information pickup, the entire world has been dumped in the Western lap. I feel so guilty here in Canada about what, we did, what we did to the Indians. After one of, uh, forgive me, um, we were talking about a, some astounding statement that some New York literary intellectual, this was the 60s, uh, had, uh, <laughs> uh, had made I think it was uh, Susan Sontag on the occasion in which she said that, um, that white people are the cancer of the human race. I think that, that was, um, and it, Marshall's comment to that was, um, well, he said, you know, moral indignation is a standard strategy for endowing the idiot with dignity. The Americans have lost their sense of identity. The country is falling apart physically and and politically because of the speed of information. The uh, American uh, bureaucracy, political the, uh, and, and educational, was set, was set up, up for very slow speeds off the print word and railways. One of the peculiarities... Well, eventually by Pat, the gap I ask you, between the what is our most cherished right since pioneer days? Paul's kid and the stand back and, and just analyze instead of experience. Politician has never really had the experience. Over. But at the same time, I don't think anybody has and the gap saved enormously just by... Between the ballot box... ...giving themselves over to an experience completely and Last night on... Last night on was box, box, box office is likewise. Um, remember, Pat Paulson was asked if he were going to run for president. The ballot box said no. Didn't you once on an ABC program say you were going to run for president? No.